I said yes to my dress. Is that what you're <laughs> Good morning, you guys. So this video has been so highly anticipated by you guys. I mean, the amount of requests. I got to film me going and trying on wedding dresses. So of course, of course, I filmed the entire experience. Say hi to Dax. Yeah. Hi, Dax. Of course, I filmed literally the entire experience. Um, Duh, I would absolutely do that for you guys. Now, obviously, I didn't include the dress I actually picked in this video because you're gonna have to wait to see that one. I had a lot of people asking me questions like, why are you going wedding dress shopping so early? I knew that my favorite wedding dress place, I had pinned the same store on Pinterest like six times and it was actually in Utah. So when I went up to Utah almost immediately after I got engaged and I'm never there and I just wanted to like give it a shot. So that's why it seemed like so fast. It was literally like three days after I got engaged and I went and here's the experience. Morning, you guys. We are going wedding dress shopping and I'm so freaking nervous. Brooklyn, on the other hand, is so excited. I am excited because I cannot wait to pick out a dress. Not that it's my dress, but I can't <laughs> wait. I'm just like, I'm nervous excited because you just dream about this for so long that I'm like, I don't want to have my expectations too high. You know what I mean? I'm just going to go in there, do what I do, and we'll I'm see. Gonna <laughs> I'm going to help. I'm going to pick out dresses and make the magic happen. And everyone keeps asking me if I have like a dress preference. I do. I just also have seen way too many say yes to the dress episodes where the brides go in there with an idea and then they leave with the opposite. So I'm trying to be very open-minded. So honestly, I'm like not even going to say what it is. What, what do you think, Riley? I'm excited. I always watch like say yes to the dress when I was like 10. So the real life version. Yeah. This is the crew. Sana. Hey. Nana. What? Mama. The twin. Rylan and Camry's supposed to be here. She's late. She's late. This is the try on group. <laughs> I want pearls. Bailey's <laughs> crew. She's just crying with excitement. She hasn't even put a dress on yet. <laughs> Are you excited to see Bailey in her first yeah, dress? I'm just cracking up over this big ball of tool I see going in. Camry made it. <laughs> Bailey's coming out in her She's first dress. Dress number two. Dress number So it's super late. We just got home from our little trip to Utah. My dad not come dress shopping with us. He's not seen the dress yet. So I'm about to get his reaction and show him pictures of the dress. I know some people wait till the wedding day, but I'm not good with like keeping these kinds of things secret. So I just want to show him right now. So let's show him. You guys can't see it either. <laughs> keeping that a secret. Thank you. Ready? So you're showing me. That dress. Oh my gosh, that's so beautiful. Not as beautiful as the girl wearing it though. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Do you like it though? It's pretty. He's like, he uh... He's like, it's cute. Baby! <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so weird for me. <laughs> Why? I don't know. My baby girl's getting married. 
So I actually booked like a full weekend of other dress appointments to go to. And that's why I'm here right now in Dallas because I had an appointment on Friday and appointments on Saturday to try and find any other dresses to see if it was actually the one I wanted or if there was a different one I wanted. And so of course I vlogged that for you guys. Bailey, wait. This is, this is one we're trying on. Yeah. <laughs> okay guys, dress number two. Took out this tray. I feel like it needed to be acknowledged because it's literally beautiful. You can see the side lace here. Dress number three. It's the first strapless one I've tried on and I'm loving it. I don't know if you guys can see. The beading is absolutely beautiful and I actually really like the see-through. I think it's like really unique, but I think I would probably add straps. I think it would just like elevate it just a little bit more. Okay, you guys, so we just finished and we absolutely loved the last dress I just tried on, which is why you didn't see a clip of it. We are gonna spend like all day tomorrow going to other shops just to confirm. And I'll have to decide between my two top two favorites. Of course, you won't be able to see any of them until I decide, so. Here's the crew. Hiya, hiya. Brooklyn's in the back. Dylan. <laughs> a lot of these appointments would only allow me to bring two people just because of COVID and stuff. So I brought the two, the two, I don't want to say the two most important because Kit hurts Cameron Ron's feelings. Well, womb. In the womb. Rylan had work and Camry had. In the womb. Utah, in her so. womb. That's why they're both here. But we are about to head into my first appointment of the day. Yesterday we went to one. Today we have three others and we're going into the very first one. shop one I think that was a bust did not find anything that we did not like better than other things she has already tried yes. on <laughs> I feel bad because the dresses are beautiful but I'm like there's one at another store that I like more and I don't know yeah. how to tell you that so I'm like, and then it's awkward because you're trying to be nice to the helpers because but you're like so I don't nice, love I'm this like, dress I really so, don't like this dress yeah this, well when what? you well I mean that's good because it just helps us narrow down to the dress yeah mm -hmm. hey we're at appointment number two we should Look. Next shop, you can see all the dress options everywhere. Okay. It has a pretty train. It does have a really pretty train. I love the beading. Like I'm the just the top. Top. Okay. More, are you thinking strapless? Or are you I think I'm more just like open. This is what I'm looking for. Embellished. <laughs> I feel like the dress is wearing you. That's how I feel. Like it. Yeah. The train on this. You want to see the train line? The, the train is a beautiful one, but this one is like. That was appointment number two. That was a good store. That was an amazing store. Like they were literally so nice. People, totally good energy. 
Let's get a reasonable Circle Park Bridal Boutique. They were freaking awesome. Ask for Abby. She was Abby was awesome. She was the bomb.com. I just really liked yesterday's dress that we found at that one bridal boutique, and nothing today has been comparing. We did this so that I could confirm whether or not the dress that I found either in Utah time. or yesterday in Dallas for the dresses. And so far, my vote is the one that I found on Friday in Dallas. I can't That's find anything that compares my to my vote. That's also my vote. Which is so, so funny because it's so like unanimous. The opposite of what and I've been asking for. For the record, not one we pulled. Not one we picked. The lady pulled it at the last second and was like, why don't you just try this one on? Because it's kind of sort of what you were talking about. And we all freaking yep. loved it. So there you go. So don't be afraid to try things that might not be what you think. Yes. That's been the motto of the rest of this trip because uh, we have one more appointment and. Okay, but yeah. this one's gonna be the interesting appointment because she's trying on the original dress. The same one. dress that I had so tried on in Utah is gonna be at this appointment, so. Okay, we're on store number three for the day and it's been funny because inadvertently we're like escalating in bougie Like we started just your generic like David's Bridal and then we worked up more to like local boutique and now apparently we're in like, uh, we're in Uptown in Dallas, which is bougie, like we valeted. Bougie people. <laughs> so we're just chuckling because the girls are like, I did not dress for this. Look how cute. It's so pretty. What do you think, Dickon? I'm just eyeballing the scenery. You're just checking them out. Every time I breathe, I can feel how I let go. Every time I see. Okay guys, so like I said, we were gonna go try, we did go to that one boutique and try on the Utah dress that I really liked that I picked out a couple, like a week or two ago. And um, in the process found another one that I really, really liked so for the same size. So that's number three, three dresses that I liked. One from yesterday in Dallas and then the two from the same designer from Utah. So I basically had to decide which of the three I wanted to be the dress. So we went back to the Dallas shop that we visited yesterday, retried on that dress, and as soon as I put it on, I was like, yeah, this is the one. And I said yes to the dress, and it's so funny because all you are gonna watch this video, like, all the dresses I tried on look very similar, and then the one I actually picked, like, is so different, and I I honestly credit that to the helper that day, what the consultant. Sharon. Sharon. I credit that to Sharon. Sharon, thank you for your eyes because I would never have pulled that for myself and now it's my choice.